Hello, I'm Steve Manning. Thank you for joining me today. I've been a graphic designer all of my career. I started out as a presentation specialist, creating computer-generated 35 millimeter slideshows, primarily for the banking and the oil and gas industries. Eventually, I worked my way up to production manager for the leading production facility in Genographic's chain of 24 offices nationwide. Due to Genographic's unique relationship with Microsoft, I was able to contribute to their clip art library and was on the team that developed the color palettes that have formed the basis of the PowerPoint and Office software platforms. In the 1990s, I became the production leader at Adplex, where we produced the eight annual full color American Airlines vacation magazines. Before everything was on the web, American used to produce and send out these beautiful magazines to travel agencies worldwide to promote their flight destinations across the globe and the affiliated resorts. In the 2000s, I was the project manager at iMedia IT, a distance learning software developer that produced simultaneously a dozen multi-year, multi-million dollar training software programs for delivery over the internet. I created the development plans for the projects, which included thousands of tasks and the identification of human resources and milestones within the timelines to meet delivery projections and budgets. I also developed and produced iMedia IT marketing materials, such as trade show banners, product handout sheets, newsletters, and promotional videos. Since that time, I have become a freelance artist. I create marketing materials for the oil and gas industry, as well as products for local brick and mortar businesses to improve their presence in the neighborhood, as well as on the internet. One of my most fulfilling enterprises is creating rehearsal dinner and special occasion videos for individuals, much like what you produce at Photo Nanny. I meet with clients and discuss their ideas and needs. We go over their collection of photos and get them into chronological as well as order of importance based upon aesthetics and pull of the heartstrings. Then it's into the studio where I can scan their photos and memorabilia, develop a storyline coupled with their musical selections and pull them all together in my software. All this takes great attention to detail and organization of a collection of materials from various sources and highlighting multiple interest groups to produce a chronicle of a lifetime of achievement that becomes a treasured resource of memory. As my videos present a compelling story of a life's work, I hope my background story presents an equally compelling narrative of reliability, creativity, and organization. Thank you.